Hi viewers, welcome to another edition of Marie Clinic Live. I remain your host, Marlai and Oputi. Please watch this interview on Must You Spend on Valentine's Day. It's an interesting right, one. Joining us is Morolayo Owokuti, a certified accountant and life coach. I hope I got that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Valentine's yeah. Day and thank you for coming on TVC Breakfast. As much you. as a lot of people are celebrating love today, Tiafilo, stop looking at me in that manner. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people are also going to be spending a lot of money buying gifts for loved ones, uh, you know, just to show love. Uh, and la as at last year, it was said that uh, Nigerians spend about 30 uh, million naira or even much, more than that, for, for buying gifts mm -hmm. and all of that. Talk to us about the business side of Valentine's Day and how people are taking advantage of this. Okay, so... Um for example, today is Valentine's Day. Even though it's a day of love, it's also a day of trade. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a day where businesses um, anticipate a lot of sales because they believe that um, lovers would want to show their loved ones that mm -hmm. they truly love them and they care and they know they will want to go out of their way to get them gift or give them some special treatment on a day like this. So I see it as an opportunity for businesses to showcase their brands, to showcase um, their products. For example, I believe that um, businesses around Valentine's Day usually start even a few days before yeah. Valentine's Day. For example, like two to three days ago, I see people sending gifts yeah. around, you know, boxes. And I'm like, okay, so Valentine has already started even before the day arrived. Well, is it, is it all about the gifts, the spending? Are there other ways to celebrate Valentine? Because like she said, about 30 uh, billion naira yeah. has been spent, spent. already. Hmm. That was last that year. Was last year. Yeah, that was last so, year. So you see, are there other ways to celebrate Valentine? Because, Well, even though um, there's this saying that um, you can't buy love, mm -hmm. but the truth is love is expensive because for you to really show someone that you love him or her, I tell you the truth, money will be involved. I mean, because some people feel like, okay, you're just telling me you love me, but I'm <laughs> you're not, not showing it. Exactly, <laughs> you're not showing it. So whichever way you want to look at it, you, you must, must buy yeah, something, you, you must, must spend, spend some money. Yeah, even if it's not All buying right. gift, you know, your loved one will be exp uh, expecting a special treatment. Absolutely, you know? <laughs> and I know that Theophilus has plans. All right, let's leave it here. Thank you for speaking with us. Until we see breakfast. Well, joining us is Morala Yawokuti, a certified accountant and life coach. Thank you very much for joining Thank us. Thank you for joining Thank us. You. Okay, so th today is Valentine's yeah. Day. <coughs> Excuse me. How do you envisage um, that, people, um, that people will spend their monies today? They're buying power. Okay. Um, I think that on a day like this, people will try as much as possible to take advantage of discounts. Because mm. I mean, yes, I mean, we, yeah, discount. exactly. Because <laughs> I we, wanted to take advantage of one yesterday. Exactly because with this recent uh, increment in VAT to seven point five, I tell you, things will be expensive. Mm -hmm. But um, during this season, you see quite a number of businesses saying, "Oh, if you buy one, you get yes, one, one free. free. Or oh, if you buy it during this Valentine season, you get as high as fifty percent discount, sixty percent so discount." You buy three so, for it for the price of free exactly so i mean it's an opportunity to get quality things for lesser prices and that is the reason why some of these businesses would tend to sell off faster during this season and you know they will smile to the bank on like if, if if it were to be an ordinary day where they insist oh you must pay the full hundred percent so i believe that people will still go out of their way to give <laughs> their loved ones you something know, yeah so something wh which which are the businesses that you think i will make the most of a day like this okay so i know that the gift shops would make some money then uh, maybe entertainment places such as um the cinemas, cinemas you know then the comedians too, they tend to have some shows around this period where couples or lovers can go to to 
you know, to spend some time. And I think restaurants too mm -hmm. will make some money during this season because whichever way you want to look at it, the Valentine this season falls on a Friday, which mm. happens to be a weekend. So even if people are busy a at work, a, a weekend celebration. yeah, all day today, I mean, by evening or tomorrow or even Sunday, you see people trying to go out to eat out just to celebrate um, their loved ones. Okay. Mm. There seems to be a lot of emphasis on spending, mm. especially amongst the, the younger generation. Uh, is how important is companionship? Mm. Is what other ways beyond spending can be used? Can we uh, celebrate, celebrate love? The Valentine's yeah. celebrate love? So um, I think that also spending time together is very important because of what use is the gift, if, is the treat, if it only happens maybe once in a while and it's not a regular practice. So I think that spending quality time with your partner or with your loved ones is very important. Fine, even in the course of spending that quality time, it might look like, okay, are we just going to stay indoors all day, mm. spending time together? Well, popcorn it, and a drink will do. Exactly. <laughs> popcorn spend and, money. and a drink will do. You still do. spend money. Exactly. You still spend money. However, in the process of spending money, let's also spend intelligently. I mean, let's love intelligently because it doesn't make sense if you as a guy goes to buy a gift on a day like this that is worth your one month salary just because <laughs> ah, you want to okay. impress a lady. Right. You know, we'll after today, we'll, we'll, we'll you will definitely go hungry. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk more on that. Thank you, Barolaya. Uh, yeah, for your talking to me.